Let me show you. See, this was last year's brown stem. And then off of this brown stem comes the new stuff. And you got fruit that would come off of this new stuff. Today, this is my deal. I got to go in and cut these raspberries back and get them trained. They're just looking, looking bad. I'll cut out the old growth from this year's growth, the stuff that we got berries on for this year and the next year's growth. You can see how long they are. Mr. Spider, sorry about that. So let's get going on that. Grab my cutters. I gotta find some gloves. These, although they look smooth, they got little pricklies on them. And uh, I've had those in my hand before quite a few times and they are not fun to try and pull out. So I'm gonna find me some gloves. Got my gloves. This one is for next year, so we will save it. These ones here, I need to save for my sister. That's last year's. Some of this stuff I'm gonna have to cut into pieces when I get it out of here. It's just not going to come out very easily because it's all put up into this trellis. This one is from last year. <clears throat> this is this year's or I should say next year's. These ones here are for next year. They are cut off a little bit too short. This one here. Oh, that was thick. Some of these there's just too many. I only need three in this clump, maybe four. So some of these are just going to have to go no matter what. There's too many. We'll take the small ones out.
All right, getting there, little by little. Next year. I'll leave those five. Now we go over here. Let's get our stuff out of the way first. Pick up our mess. I'm gonna have to take my sweatshirt off. I'm getting hot. This one here. We're getting there. Oh, no. All right. You can see how tall these don't have any excess branches coming off of them. Anything higher than here, I think. So I'm going to bend these over. And if I have to, I will tie them.
but they should be able to weave in well enough. I think I'll just continue to go this way and I'll bend the other side the other way. There we go. One more. This guy. Come over the top. Underneath, like that. This one, we will go this way. Over this one, and then I'm gonna, because it's so pliable, I'm gonna weave it through. There. Now these ones, I think I may just cut these off. Well, at least this one, because it was cut. Here's a good spot right where the thing is, the node. Okay. This way, coming through. So I have one, two, three wires here, plus this hard member. And I just weave them through the second, the first and second wire. They are pretty pliable, but I, I don't like to push too hard. There. Now that's looking a whole lot better. The ones over here, these guys, you can see my first two wires, my third wire up here. Last year I tied them straight up and it was just, they were out of control, it was too much. No need for uh, tying down, I've got them all interlaced in between these wires here, so they should be fine for the winter. And then the new growth, you'll see, will come off of these new buds, all these buds here. That's where your new growth will come for next year. And that's where your raspberries, your fruit, comes off each of those. And they'll come up here. That's why you want to keep them as low as possible. So there you go. All right. You guys have a good day. I got some cleanup to do.